from the new one I think this, this is the economic report the Swiss Bay work economic forum has released its late global competition this report the report raised the Wheatland as the work most of the competitive country for a uh, seven year right? on the list was Singapore and the United States are the among the top ten general need to accept reforms to improve productivity. They also need to support entrepreneurs, people who start new businesses. Most countries report economic growth, but growth is weaker than before the 2008 financial crisis. The report warns that some developing countries that fail to compete enough will not be able to deal with future economic shocks. Margareta dresnik Hanuz is with the World Economic Forum. She says digital technology in machinery and manufacturing is important worldwide, but it is the human factor that is critical to competitiveness, she says. That means education and flexibility of the labor market. The 2015-2016 report used 12 groupings to rate nations. These include roads and other infrastructure, health and primary education, business sophistication and innovation. The report says the larger emerging markets are making little progress in competitiveness. The exceptions are India and South Africa. The report says China ranked 28th, but it says China's failure to move up in the rankings shows the country is facing some difficult economic issues. For VOA Learning English, I'm Ann Ball.